Okay, moving on. Uh, I do not need the fox. I already have one. As a model, I'll show off the appeal of my partner Pokemon. Will you now? As a not model, I will kill your Pokemon. Ow! You're... You're making me want to do terrible things to you. Uh, I don't actually know. I know the song, I just don't know the answer to that. Okay, Vanillite, can you, like, ruin this thing? For me? Be a pal? Don't use Stun Spore, you jerk. Don't paralyze me, you're a d and it And I'm paralyzed! And here comes Dazzling Gleam. See, if I'd used Hail turn one, we might be fine, but no. Well. This vanilla is just having a bad day. Well, I was trying not to have Corviknight just kill everything in the game for me, but I don't have a choice. Kill it. How, how are you? I want to know how it's so accurate with that thing. Just get wrecked and get out of my face. Ow. Uh, no. No, I, I, this will also kill Vespa Queen. You can exert as much pressure as you want. I'm just gonna do this, and you're gonna go away. Bye, Vespa Queen. Have I mentioned that, like, this is my main Pokemon for the speedrun? This is my main Pokemon for the speedrun. It just continues to show how good it is. Keep in mind, this model isn't optional. I should never hit her in the speedrun. What is o oh, Hi. Well, not allowed to go that way, apparently. Is it possible to bypass this guy? No. He's forced. What was that thing I saw over there? Behind the fox? Oh, hey. You also have a Corvus Choir. Okay, well, I'm not allowed to set up anymore. That's a shame. Let's see. So that's 105. This is at Night Slash is actually a stronger move. Cool. I like it when, I, like, the move that I was thinking about is the stronger move. It's kind of neat that Night Slash is actually stronger on Little One than, um...
Yeah, you 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 do that aerial ace. You do that. Also, take damage. Level 36, little one. No matter where I go, and my taxi, loss and loneliness seem to follow. If you don't attack me, I wouldn't do bad things to you. Okay, you. Yes. Is this a Persian? Perserker? What? Also, hello, Garvantula. Galvantula. Ow. Of course you crit. <clears throat> Am I gonna crit? Nope. Okay, tell you what. You just sit over there. I have Golette. And one more for good measure. Aw, oh, man! Of course I crit! Why- why did I crit? <laughs> why was that necessary? Why do I always crit when I don't want it? I never crit when I do. Okay, I need a Galvangelo, though. Oh, neat. There was a... Okay, so here's a question. Inkay. Inkay normally levels up when the Switch... Or when the, uh, the 3DS is turned upside down. So how in the hell do I level it up... Or do I evolve it now? Also, I am in no small way amused that my Golette is amused to every attack this thing has. Oh, wait, it has Sucker Punch. I take it back. <laughs> I take it back. I'm not immune to that. I mean, it makes perfect sense if you look at Inkay, In or if you look at, um, I can't remember the name of Inkay's uh, evolution. Its evolution is literally it upside down. Please don't get faster. Oh, uh, you probably have like to hold the controller upside down, because the controllers do have motion controls. Ow. Please don't do that. That hurts. Do me a favor. Get in the ball. No! Get in the ball. Okay, well, I'm going to Earth Power. Yeah, Discharge doesn't work on me. Okay, please don't die. Thank you. Get in the ball. Base, we're going to have to do that test again. Wait. Fuck you! Get in the ball!
Okay, we're doing the test again. Do not ask me why I chose to send Inteleon out as opposed to Cor uh, Corviknight. Uh-oh. Mistakes were made. It's fine, though. Get in the ball. Nope. Crap. Why, why would you slash now? Why would you do that? Get in the ball. Get in the ball. Thank you. <laughs> it's okay. Secret Agent Man lives. I was going to feel really silly if my main was actually a woman, but that's fine. Launches electrified fur from its abdomen as its means of attack. Opponents hit by the fur could be in three in for three full days and nights of paralysis. Oh, that sounds terrible. Also, being attacked by uh by spider fur. <laughs> Uh, the Reggie Trio weren't that bad. What are you talking about? I solved that as a kid. I think part of it is like that Inke actually does turn upside down. And the three... And, uh... X and Y were the first, um, like, it actually does turn upside down. I think there's references to it elsewhere. Yeah, that, that's why we were, that's why we were talking about Inke, because it's right here. Can you get paralyzed, please? Thank you. Ah, your shit doesn't affect me. I really don't want to kill this thing on accident. Yeah, it... What What is your problem with Braille on a screen? It's really not hard. Like, again, I did this as a child. Like, what? what's the problem? Well, they gave you a cipher. A cipher. I actually went and looked up the translate. I actually like went and looked at how you translate Braille. Are you telling me you didn't learn Braille as a kid? Like, or at least learn what it is? Like, I, I recognized it by sight. And I, I realize that I'm saying that I recognized by something by sight that's meant for blind people. But I recognized what it was just by seeing it. Yeah, the first room is actually a Braille trans, uh, translation, but... I knew what Braille was. I just went and looked up on the internet, you know, ha like what Braille was letter by letter, and then I went and figured out what it was. Is isn't there isn't there a like a Pokemon game where you had to translate Morse code for some reason? You get in the ball. Thank you. I swear there's a hint for Inke that tells you to turn the 3DS upside down. It spins while making its luminescent spots flash. These spots allow it to communicate with others by using different patterns of light. I mean, keep in mind, the city that I used to live in, like, actually had a school for the blind. So maybe that's... Ah! I don't want to fight this.
Oh, I'm checking something. Yeah, like, the literal first room of the ruins is the letters of the alphabet in alphabetical order in Braille. So apparently, the hint is that you see Malamar. That's the hint. If you go look at Malamar, Malamar is literally in K upside down. And that's the hint. I had to actually, I, I went and looked up right now how you're supposed to know this. But that's the hint that the game gives you. Is that you see its evolution. The fact that it has a move called Topsy Turvy. That the ability is called Contrary. And it's you're supposed to figure it out from there. Uh, okay. You you asked how you're supposed to figure it out. That's how you're supposed to figure it out. Ah, uh, that's a Roselia. Uh, okay. Now yeah, we're gonna... My home cause. No, you don't look it up upside down to see Malamar. Malamar gets used by multiple trainers in X and Y. How would you assume the console would know it's upside down? Mm-hmm. I mean, keep in mind, the fact that the 3DS had a gyro was a very well-known thing at the time. Like, the 3DS used gyro controls for a lot of stuff. I'm not sure what your point is. I outright just said that it was known the 3DS could detect motion. Yes, you have to think of that. Like, what? I'm not sure what you're... I'm not sure what the problem is. What do you mean no one would? Tons of people figured this out. It wasn't a secret. Like, people figured this out. Like, that's an understandable one. Talk to me about no how, how do you know that, like, uh, uh, uh what's the, what's the Pokemon? Um, freaking, uh, I, I just had it. The, uh, Steeny only evolves to Starina when it knows Stomp. How about Poipole that only evolves into Nagadanel when it knows that one freaking um, poison move, I think it's like Venishok, but it doesn't come to you as Venishok, so you have to go and move learn it. Come on. there, There's other shit that's more bullshit than that. The, uh, on a scale of one to bullshit, like... Mm, no. There, there, there's actually hints for, uh, for, uh, Malamar in the game. Some of this shit there's no hints for. I'm still trying to figure out how you evolve Linawan into Obstagoon. My original guess was it had to know Lick, and apparently I was wrong, so my new guess right now is that it just has to be, like, level 40 or something. Uh, 
Ender Lord, that's not even the worst of it. Did you ever play a game called Trace Memory? Oh my god. You also had to close the 3DS for that hint. See, Water Girl, you say that. It wasn't back in the uh back in the day. This wasn't a common thing. Like I'm I'm trying to think there was um uh Pillow Swine, I think, was the first one to do it. And how did you figure that out? Like, this Pokemon has to know a move that isn't even one of its types in order to evolve. What? Pillow Swine is snow ground. Ancient power is rock. I know, but what I'm saying is, like, there are times when the Pokemon is... Ugh, okay, cool. It didn't kill itself. There are times when Pokemon are the first ones to have an evolutionary style. Like... Dude! Fuck off. You're in Red Bar. Accept this and move on. Oh, well, little one's gonna die. Thank you. Cool. Now I don't have to level that up or evolve that thing. Golette hits. Uh, Golette, sure, yes, please y learn Mega Punch. Uh, yeah, we're not using Curse, so go ahead and do that. Its body is entirely hollow. When it opens its mouth, it sucks everything in as if it were a black hole. That is terrifying. Like, I'm legitimately surprised we haven't had, like, a soda pop Pokemon that you have to evolve by shaking the console, okay? Oh, that's right. It was cursed, not a... Uh... Yeah. Linoon? It's L-I-N-O-O-N-E. So I don't, I don't know why you'd call it Line. I've called it Linoan since since the original time I got one. Well, evolved one. Uh, take down. Well, let's change to Golette. Like, I guarantee you there were hints towards, uh... What's it called? There, there were hints towards Malamar somewhere. Because, like, there were hints towards Gudra, and Gudra you had to evolve while it was raining. There was a hint somewhere. I have, I have no idea how you get Linoon from that spelling. If it was L-Y-N, I could get it. But there's no E to make the I long. Why did I do that? There's no E to make the I long, and there is an E at the end. So the O should be long. I don't know. I'm, I'm still calling it Linoon. I'm I'm not I'm not accepting this this reality. Cuz that that's uh, 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 the O makes the That's not how it works. That is not how that works. Before you ask, no, that is not a shiny thing down there. Ooh, smart strike. User stabs the target with a sharp horn. His attack never misses. Uh, 
What the crap is that yellow thing down there? You guys see that? Hold on, I want to see what's... Uh, there's a... Hi, Golette. Linotype is... That might be what it is. It might be that it's it's off of Linotype. And that's how you're supposed to know. I'm still calling it Linowin because that's what I've been calling it for a long time. I don't care. Nope. I mean, I'll accept the reality. I'm still not going to pronounce it right. I'll, I'll accept that that's where the name comes from. Oh, no. I'll accept the reality. I'm still not changing how I pronounce the name. I've pronounced the name this way since... What is that? Gen 3 came out? I'll accept it, but I'm not going to pronounce it right. Okay. Let's just let's just pull this Golette back out and let Golette take care of this. I'll completely accept that I'm saying it wrong. Supposed, like, how was a child supposed to know about a linotype machine? Like, what the shit, man? Also, let's see what let's see how much damage Mega Punch does. Ow. Fuck you, man. Fuck you in that flinch. Also, Rock Slide is not this accurate. Fuck you. Uh, the game comes out significantly before the anime does, so I'm not so sure about that one. I can't remember if a little one got me, got me that high. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, what? Wait, wait, no, 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 no. Go back for a second, what? My, my, did I, did I do a stupid? Hold up. For some reason, I keep on thinking that Ghost doesn't work against freaking fighting, and I don't know why I feel why I think that. Also, you, you're an asshole. Stop doing that. I don't know why I th I know fighting doesn't work against Ghost. I don't know why I think the Ghost doesn't work against fighting. Okay, be paralyzed. Nope, you're an and you and you hit. Oh, you're an asshole. Blech. See, you're probably right, but like, there's a reason that I think that that in my head, that psychic is super effective against ghost, and there's actually a good reason for this for this. 
The reason I think that Psychic is super effective against Ghost is because it was super effective against Gengar in Gen 1. So I went back. I had to. I had to go back and look, and I was checking to see if the Gen One type ups had uh, Ghost not work against fighting. I need to heal my shit. You two, stop being useless. Be useful. Uh, no, not that. Stop dying to everything. Yeah, it's because Gengar is half poison. Yep. Oh, he came Gengar. Yeah, that's not a Gengar, but. But the, re the reason why I thought Gen that uh, Psychic was super effective against uh, Ghost is because it's super effective against Ghastly, Haunter, and Gengar, But because those, those were the only three Ghosts, but it's because of the poison. No, I don't want you to learn Counter. Okay, well, we're going to move on. What? Really? This is only up here to see this sign? Checking out glowing Pokemon dens in the wild area will help you store up watts. If you climbed all the way up here, you're likely to start to investigate every nook and cranny. So keep that curiosity alive to search out every last den and search out the wild area, too. Damn it, game! That's not okay! What the shit? Oh. You climbed all the way up here expecting to see something important, but no, it was just a sign saying, you climb everywhere, therefore go check this shit out too. Fuck you, game. Uh, I came over here already, right? Yeah. 